Hi everyone, Caroline here. Okay, I'm going to have a, have a little play with Imala today. And um, I'm going to be using the Forever Yours and um, some of Timeless Beauty for this sentiment. And I'm also going to use the Stamps by Me Quattro D. So, not done this before, so this is all uh, a new uh, a new one that I'm doing. Um, I've done a, a mask uh, with the uh, masking paper. So I'm going to st st stick that on because I've already stamped that out on there. And I will stick that on there. Because that's where I want her. Get her right. She's gorgeous, isn't she? So she's going on there. some paper underneath here. That's it. And with the Quattro D, um, obviously it's the, it's the four system where you've got your stamp, your layering stencils, your outline die and your embossing folder. But I'm just going with stencils for this. This is the number one. It's a bit of a driver. Oops. So what I want is I want the shoe at the side of her there. That's why I've masked her off because um, I just wanted this sh this shoe at the side there. I'm going to use the Distress Oxide Black Soot. Oops. As you can see, I've gone directly onto the card. So there's no layering or anything like that. Take that off. Even that, you've got a fantastic shoe on its own. Number two uh, actually takes in the inside there and the base here. So, I'm just going to get um, a finger dauber. Because I want this even darker inside like that and again just on the sole because this bit here does the sole of it see it's darkened it inside don't need to use uh, well, I will use number three uh, just to uh, add a bit of darkness I think on that again just place it where you think you want it because obviously I'm directly on the card so I don't want to um, mark the card it. 
there. I'll just get a cloth for my fingers. stencils off give them a quick wipe so they don't get too uh, too stained let's move that okay now we can stamp our lady okay so I'll take this off there. Now I know what you're thinking, you're thinking, well, why is this all blocked off? Well, I'll show you. I'm going to get my black liner pen and I'm going to go down with um, the dress like that. So that's the dress. the heel of the shoe there we have it go and wipe my fingers my cloths are going a bit dry and what I'm going to use is I'm going to use my pencils I use the uh, the, the Castle Art Supply Soft Series and uh, so I don't leave on that shoe I'll cover it I'll just cover that and then I'm not leaning on it with my cuff and I'm just going to colour in because when you stamp directly onto your card um Obviously, you don't want to be using alcohol markers because it'll go through. That's why most people matte and layer uh, if they want to use paints or alcohol markers. But with pencils, it doesn't throw through. These, uh, these soft series are lovely to use. I got mine on eBay. Somebody was selling on eBay, so I picked them up quite cheap. So it's always worth looking if somebody's uh, stopped doing their um, crafting and want to sell on. So I'll just get a bit of a darker one now, just to do a bit of shading.
touch it around the hairline. Like that. So we've got all the skin done. dress uh, I'm going to do uh, in a red so really this is just to show you about stamping directly onto your card without any matte and layering and to still enjoy your stamps I hope you're enjoying the uh, the weekly Imola inspiration. We're having fun with our stamps. We used to do the lives on a Wednesday. But um, just think, uh, I'm going to make that into a pocket. She's sort of got a hand in a pocket there. Like a double pocket. That's good, isn't it? Um, but I um, uh, spoke to Carly about it and it, it was decided that it was better if I did the videos like this. You can always go back to them whereas the lives you can't always find on facebook or you've got to trawl through and it's just not as good as being as having the uh, videos the lives are nice now and again for a little bit of uh, interaction and chat etc but um this is a darker one this is the old two three Uh, the videos are better they reach more people and um, like I say you can go back to them as many times as you like if you forget something that you've done bootmark any that you you particularly enjoyed. So a little bit of shade in here. Love this ruffle. It's gorgeous, isn't it? And also, without mat and layering, etc., you're not worried about it um, having to go um, larger letter if you're posting. So that helps as well, doesn't it? You know, you could just add some lovely red glitter on this and do a Merry Christmas for, you know, your girlfriends or your family females that you want to do a card for and 
you know, it's, it's beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. I might do a Christmas card with it. And, uh, do a hair. Nice blonde hair. And a bit of shading darker colors you can go two three different shades you know with these with these castle ones can you see all the different shades you get uh, they're very very good i love them and that's just a few of them i've got so uh, i'll show you i've got the greens the browns the grays all the yellows the blues the purples the pinks, the reds. These are the other extras with the skin tones. Oh, brilliant. Just to sit and colour and enjoy. Okay. I think that will do. Might just add just a little tint of orange in there. Just a there we are. And a little bit, little bit of brown. See, just by adding a few extra colours in, you know, it's given it um, uh, better depth, hasn't it? I'm going to do her glasses a bit of a a tint. A bit of a pink tint and her lips a bit of red lipstick oh yes 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 so there we have that that's lovely isn't it um I'm going to go back in now and I'm going to do a sentiment on it. How simple was this card, eh? And yet, fabulous to send to people. And you can put happy birthday on or... I've got this one from uh, the Timeless Beauty. You've, pro you've probably got that if you've got the whole collection. True elegance is timeless. There we are. And of course you can add a little bow here. If you can get one, uh, you know, stamp out or die cut a little bow to stick on and then it all remains flat. Or you can, you know, if you're going to go large letter, you can put a, a satin bow on. But when you look inside, can you see it's not gone through? So you can do any uh, sentiment inside then as you like. Well, I hope you've enjoyed that and thanks very much for watching. Bye bye.